after a year like no other, it is fantastic to be standing here in the middle of the city of Perth for the 2020 Make Smoking History Targa West. We have an unbelievable four days coming up. Sun is shining, a great feel of over 50 cars. Today is all about the Bendigo Bank Leg 1. We're heading away from here in the city to Whiteman Park, some traditional stages around there. We then go back into Wanneroo Raceway and, of course, finish tonight with Allenbrook, the super stages in and around the precinct there. Recommend you go and see that if you haven't been there before. But here we are at the start. Perfect time to go and chat to some of the leaders and some of the key players in this year's event. So John O'Dowd, our two-time state rally champion, but you're very handy on the tarmac and a different car on the entry list this year. Tell us about this. Different car yet again, yeah. Um, look. You know, we, we tried to get this car for uh, Targa Southwest to have a day in it and run it and then uh, have some miles under our belt before we got to here, but it wasn't to be. Um, and now we're here, so uh, I'm sure the first few stages will be interesting. But uh, look, it's a great car. It's got great pedigree. I think it's won four times, so no, we, no pressure. we might have a bit of bad news for it this year. But uh, look, we're going to get out and have some fun in it and uh, yeah, see how we go. Simon Gunson, great to have you back for another year of uh, Tiger West and you are the guy they're all gunning for in the classics apparently again. How are you feeling? Oh, yeah, apparently. Um, no, feeling good. Um, cars, uh, same as last year, it's all, all going good. So, yeah, we're, we're hoping to do back-to-back -back if we can. That's the aim. Now, a few of the people are telling us that a little last-minute car wasn't quite ready to go. If you're, have you rolled out of the garage without much being done to it or have you had to do a bit of work to it? Oh, well, last Wednesday the engine was out of the car. We found a bit of timing chain in the sump. Nothing unusual, you know, but... These are the things. Problems before target means we have a good target, you see, so we're all ready to go. So if it was too easy on the lead up, you'd be not happy coming into here. You'd feel like something's not quite right. That's right. Whenever we had an easy lead up, we've had problems at target, so we're confident. Okay. And look, great feel, great feel of, of classics as well. That's what you're focused on. Uh, so it's got the makings of a really, really great uh, year, hasn't it? Yeah, it has. I mean, it's been a strange year, and we weren't sure how the numbers would be and stuff like that. But yeah, it's a great field and uh, lots of classic cars, lots of different cars. So yeah, it's going to be a great, great weekend. Can't wait to see you back out there again, mate. Good on you. Me too. Thanks, guys.